Hi, Christy Fobb here at Lot 648 Hawkside Drive in Apache Junction here in the resort of Golden Vista. So here in the community, we're in the northwest section of Golden Vista here. And if you pan down here to our west, so we're just about four homes in, four to five homes in from the west side of the community down on this side. And then if you go down in this direction to our right, this is the far east side, you'll see those beautiful superstition mountains right out here in this area where you see that biker crossing. That is the person that's just right, that is the uh, section that cuts right up and down the middle. That's your main um, access that gets you to the clubhouse down in that area. And then further on on the other side is the rest of the homes. That's the far eastern corner. Like I said, this is the northwest corner up here of the Golden Vista Resort. Don't mind the beautiful sun that we have here in Arizona, right in my eyes. It's beautiful out today, trying to decide whether or not we're in the long sleeve or short sleeve. It's, it's beautiful here. Uh, regardless, we're here to look at this beautiful home, 648 Hawkside here. We're gonna start by going around the outside. Do notice, before I do that, this is a north facing home. So this is north and south facing, so you would be facing toward the north direction. So you are going to get some of those beautiful superstition mountain views here from this home once we head up to the patio. But let's start by going around and looking at the features of the outside of the home to start with. So number one here at 648, you'll notice that they have this nice front area. It's currently landscaped with all the rocks and finishes here. Could be something that if you wanted to, you could use this for parking in uh, your golf cart, just like a lot of uh, other people do in the community, or you could leave it as is, as your just nice, nice approach to the home and something that you could uh, decorate up. One other thing that you notice on this is the whole exterior of the home has recently been painted. So this is a 1994 Skyline home, all the exterior painted as well as the railing that's around the deck. And then you have that nice Trex deck area there for the landing. So one nice feature that they've, they've complimented here. Going around the side of the home here, once again, they carried that paint all the way through. So you can see that all the way around. Basically the section right here where it goes to where the rock ends, this is this is your ownership with this land and then it cuts off to this, own, this on the other side. So you kind of have this split right between. This is somewhat of your common area between the two properties and then we'll continue on around. Once again, this is nice, a little bit of a nice cactus that are, are well blooming here. You've got some aloe verde, some other things like that. This property is nice because once again, it does have some pavers out here. So this is your back patio area. Once again, don't mind the sun. It's a beautiful day here in Arizona, squinting just a little bit. Um, but these patio pavers out here in the back side, so this gives you a nice area to just sit up here and relax and enjoy a little bit of it. One thing I'm going to point out to you is this is a water hookup. So one thing to notice with Golden Vista is that with the water, it is included with your HOA, your water, sewer, and trash is included with your homeowners association payment because you do own the land here in Golden Vista. Water, sewer, and trash, and then all the community amenities. Such a fabulous deal. Continuing on around, we'll pop through this and you'll see this on the inside, but this is the back door access here. And then once again, it was continued through and around the property. So you need to see the painting here. Right here, you'll notice there is a nice parking spot. So you don't have a, a difficulty trying to find a vehicle that you can fit into the space. You can pretty much fit just about anything in this space. Um, in addition, they have this little bump out here. I know the prior owners were putting their motorcycle here. So they have that additional space for their summer or winter, their winter getaway vehicle here on this side. And then they could also easily park their vehicle without any issues. So let's just head on in the Arizona room here. We'll start on this side. It does have these nice double doors to get in here. One thing you'll notice when you come in is that it does have some beautiful tile floors, so low maintenance easy access for keeping things in here, cleaning, and not having any issues with spills or worries about grandkids if you happen to have them over. Very nice in that way. They did use this as their main living area space. So obviously they have the TV set up here. It's wide enough and you definitely have enough stretching room in here for everyone. Um, in addition to the living area down here, they do have two 
pretty deep storage areas. Um, one on this side, and then you have an access that's on the other side. They don't go all the way through, but this one does cut quite a ways back in there. So a lot of good storage space in this one. Nice tape and textured wall finishes. You can see there's no wall board or anything down here. I don't see any popcorn up above. Nice ceiling fans. So that makes it really nice. Does have the nice Santa Fe color finishes in here as well. So that kind of goes with the theme of the area. So that's got a nice extra touch. And then you'll continue up the tile stairs. to the park model side. So right out this way, one of the first things you'll notice is the big open kitchen area it has this nice U-shaped kitchen that opens into the front front dining area, which they're obviously using as just their main dining. They have a larger table here, makes it nice. They have the fitted with the microwave stove. You've got all of the things that you see in this home does stay with it. Lots of countertop space in this one. You've got lots of counter storage space. You also have a skylight looking up, which is right above the kitchen. Ideal place where you want that extra light to be able to cook up that, that masterpiece. In addition to that skylight, not only did they, do they have that redone, but they have a new roof that was recently done within the last year. So lots of peace of mind with this one, having all the new paint and the new roof installed. Once again, you'll see all the space around here. One thing I wanna point out, like I pointed out down in the Arizona room is it does have this tape and textured wall finish. You don't have any wall board. So this is all a dry walled finish with, not sure what the texture is on this, but your, your typical texture. So it done really, really well. And we're gonna head back into the, the bathroom and the, bath, the bedroom. All right, having a hard time there. One thing you'll notice as you're coming back in this area is this flooring. Up in this park model side, it, there isn't any tile, but this new laminate um, luxury flooring is a waterproof vinyl. I, I we'll have to look it up. I've got it right down there, so I'll show it to you. But it's a waterproof flooring that is throughout this whole upstairs park model side in the bathroom as well as the bedroom. So it's a nice, beautiful finish in here. And then right down here in the bathroom, or right over here in the bathroom, this is one of those nice ones that does have uh, the converted walk-in shower. So it was a tub that they had to cut out. So it makes ease of getting in, less, less of a trip hazard for that shower access. Not only do you have that with this one, but you also have the double door. So you could come in right here off the hall, or you could also come through to, through your bedroom, which makes it nice. Easy access in, easy access out. You'll notice that they do have the linen closet storage here. We're gonna head on through the bathroom, come right in here to the bedroom. Here in the bedroom, you'll notice there's the queen size bed. Like I said, everything does stay with this. Once again, the Santa Fe finishes with the colors. Storage up above the double closets, which is nice for the his and hers with the dresser that was built in just between them. And you each have the storage drawers down below. So that makes it nice. Good amount of space and once again, a good finish. And we have the ceiling fan as well. All of these do have pocket doors. If we head back out here of the bedroom, you notice there's a pocket door here. Nice for you to be able to close off your space from this. Um, so you have the privacy. And then if you wanted to use this Arizona room as guest quarters for someone else, you could easily do that and they can close this off as well for your closed off area. One more thing, let's take a look. I was going to show you, point this out, that that new flooring that was just installed, they even added in some extra, just in case you ever had any issues with it. So it is the Smart Floor Premium Waterproof Flooring. So you'll see that right here, the Smart Core. And that's one more thing, we'll take a look outside finish on our Superstition Mountain Views because that's what we're all here for, to enjoy the outdoor living and everything that Golden Vista has to offer us here um, with the heated pools, the heated party hot tub, lots of games, activities, wood shop, shuffleboard, softball, you name it, it's all here. And just below the Superstition Mountains, right in the shadows here. Give me a call if you'd like to see it in person. I'd love to show it to you. 
520-424-6819. Christy Fobb. Thank you.